You're awake now. Are you dizzy, sweetheart? No. I had a very weird dream. Hey, hello. Hey, how are you doing? Sorry, I couldn't call you yesterday. I was working rather late. John, John. No need to worry. Everything's just been discussed. The bosses have agreed. It'll just be a few days vacation. The Chrysalis Laboratories aren't going to burn down in a week. No. I keep it at home in my personal laboratory. You don't have to worry about it. It's safe. It's behind a security door with a numeric keypad. No one's going to get in there. I have to settle this now. The contractors were supposed to come this week, and I haven't been able to tidy it all up. John, you know all the work I've been doing. I've spent too much time away from my family. And we have a lot to celebrate as well. Okay, I'll call you later. Goodbye. Ben, take the radio. Let's see if you can hear me. Ben, you have to do your homework and tidy your room and eat all your vegetables. <laughs> now you. Irene. Don't make noise near my laboratory. My time machine isn't a toy. <laughs> ben, the batteries are going to run out. I wish I could invent a pill that would make you listen to me. Paul, don't be so grumpy. Dad, what did the builders do to the house? What an inquisitive little girl. She doesn't miss a trick. Well, we installed a pan- Paul, what Dad means is that they've replaced some pipes. When you all get home, you won't notice any difference. Oh, the pills! Irene was supposed to have taken them already. Relax. As long as she's not anxious, it's no problem if she takes them later. I can give them to her after dinner. Are you sure? <laughs> of course I'm sure. I'm her doctor, isn't that right, honey? Yes. I'll take Irene to the bathroom. Ben, would you do me a favor and help me find the flashlight? I don't know where I left it last time. We need it in order to flip on the fuses. I found it! Good work. Come with me. The fuse box is downstairs in the basement. Ben, I need to get this. The fuses are downstairs in the laundry room. Can you go down and flip them on?
Ben, can you see the fuse box? Ben, you have to switch on the basement light. There we go. He's in the kitchen. Great. Chrysalis shares have gone up. <sighs> Another disappearance in the area. What a pity. It was so quiet. Thank goodness this house is secure. Dad, Irene's throat is sore again. Don't worry about it. Man, Mom's burger. Watch your sister. Best. Help set the table. <laughs> the bottle of wine as well. It's on the counter. <laughs> we can't have soda with dinner, but they can have wine? Not fair. Dinner's ready. 
Everything was delicious. It's time for you to take your pills. How many are left? Not many. I need to get her more. If you're going to the drugstore in town, would you mind if I went with you? I can go and play with Pete and Ronald. Ben, when I go into town, I'll have a lot of things to do. I won't be able to take you here and there. But, Dad... <sighs> now, Ben, honey, your dad said he can't. Come on, finish your dinner. We'll all go together another time, and you can see your friends if you like, okay? <laughs> Here you are, honey. It looks like there'll be heavy rain tonight. Make sure all the windows are shut tight when you go upstairs now. Can we go play prisoners? We're not sleepy. No? Okay. Now let's play a game where you've escaped from your cell and you have to find the key to get out of the castle. But if I find you, you lose. Hide! Hurry up! And remember, you have to find the key and escape before I catch you. One... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Here I come. Here's the key. Now I just have to get I'll out of here. <gasps> I heard you. I'm going to find you. Now let's play a game where you've escaped from your cell and you have to find the key to get out of the castle. But if I find you, you lose. Hide! Hurry up! And remember, you have to find the key and escape before I catch you. One, two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Here I come. Here's the key. Now I just have to get out of here. <gasps>
you won't escape. No one gets out of my dungeon. Where did he go? I'll find you. No one escapes from my castle. Never get away from me! Aha! There you are! <laughs> I'm free! Children, free! dad's back from town. I think it's about time you went to bed, don't you? going on? I can't sleep. Can you come here? Dad sent us to bed. If he sees me awake, he'll get angry. You said Terrace. They won't see you that way. Why aren't you in bed? I don't want to sleep. When I take my pills at night, I always have nightmares. Irene, you have to sleep. You only have nightmares if you believe you're going to have them. This. I think one of the lights outside is burned out. I'm going to take a look. Take an umbrella. Now that the kids are asleep, I'm going to check something. Are you going up to the laboratory? No, I'm going to check the installation. An installation? It must have something to do with the construction work. Then, we have to find out what it is. I'll go first. You wait here. If Dad sees that we're still up, he'll be real mad. Where did he go? Did you find anything? I saw Dad go in, but he disappeared. Mm -hmm. Dad left, a tool on the panel moved. Cool. <gasps> so cool. What is it? I know 
what it is? I think it's called a panic room. I saw one like this on TV. People use it to hide if a thief breaks into the house. This probably locks the door, right? Don't touch anything. Oh, wow! You can see who's coming up to the door with this! The rooms all have microphones. You can hear what's happening all around the house. Let me go! <gasps> that was Mom's voice. those people I don't know but they look dangerous stay with me please I'm scared I'm scared too but it's mom and dad I can't just leave them on their own close the door call the police and don't open up for anyone Kids, let me in. Come on, I have a little surprise for you. I'm going to look into the camera. <sighs> it must be the kids. They've hidden themselves in the panic room. Ashley, honey, are you sure the phone doesn't work? Of course. I cut the line. Mike, did you leave our hosts in the basement? Yeah. So, where's this prestissimo subito coming from? The situation is under control. If we find the other kid, we'll take care of him. Children can't do us any harm. What if the father doesn't cooperate and we need her? He'll cooperate. Is it... is it a monster? Whatever it is, it has mom and dad. Ben, what they said is true. The phone isn't working. What are we going to do? I can hear a cell phone vibrate. Can you see it? I am the mother's cell phone. It must be the father. The girl can hear dad's cell phone. Look at the cameras. Can you see where it is? Dad left his cell phone charging.
substance. What should I do? Hang up or let it ring? All you can do are practical jokes? Take off that fucking mask! If you do something like that again, I'll... What? <laughs> what are you going to do? to hang in there a few hours, and I'll have the money. Irene, the girl picked up the phone before me. What do we do? I don't know. Then you need to talk to Mom and Dad. Surely they'll think of something. <laughs> the big guy took them to the basement. They're in the cellar. <laughs> Ashley, come on. You have to hack this thing.
stop screaming before we go. This, my dear Richters, is the opera of your life. Or what is left of it. After the overture, and with it, our entrance, it is time to move on to your first recitative. Since there's no rush now, we're going to slow down the rhythm a bit to a larghetto. My soprano's waiting for me upstairs, so I will leave you in the hands of this virtuous baritone. Mike, darling, treat them as they deserve. I usually do this with professionals. It's much easier. Soon as they see me, they know what awaits them. Many begin to speak before I approach them. The others end up telling me what I want sooner or later. Then I get my money and go. Unless it's personal. Like now. In the study, there is a metal box with money in it. The key to it is hidden under the pencil holder. There's also a- Shut up. Where is it? There's also money in the safe. There are jewels. You can take the car. What is it that you want? You know what I want. Paul? I wanted to be a boxer. I could have been the best, but I made a mistake. Confronted someone wilder than me. The same thing that happened to you. Are you gonna tell me where it is? I can't. You'll change your mind. What are you doing? Oh my god. Oh my god, please don't do this. <gasps> Start talking fast, the two of us will regret it. What are you doing? Are you crazy? Your job is to make him talk, not kill him. Am I the only one here who hasn't lost her mind? Come with me. Stop telling me how I should go about doing things. You're not in charge. Your job here is to hack the lab computer. Otherwise, you have no fucking say. If you kill him, we may not be able to get into the lab. Ah. Your sister. Don't worry, Irina's safe. She's in the panic room. 
Ben. You have to go get help. I can't. There's no way. These people have cut off the telephone lines. And all the doors are locked, too. I don't know what to do. Computer. Study. Of course, your laptop. Your dad's computer is in the study. Contact the police. Give them the address of the house and tell them what's going on. Please hurry. Those disappearances. Surely these guys are the ones responsible for them. Irene, I'm trying to get into Dad's computer to ask for help online, but it's locked. I need Dad's password to get in. There's some kind of riddle, but I don't get it. It says something about comfort. ...and a seed to heal the damage. Dad was reading a poetry book in the library. It looked very old. Maybe it has something to do with this.
a note here in Dad's handwriting. Redemption. This must be the password for the computer. I hear something around here. <laughs> Looks like it was nothing. It works! is Ben Richter. There are three intruders in my house. Matt? What's happening? Naughty boy? There's someone in the study! We almost got him. Has he called anyone? Well, he tried. I put a program that blocks any attempts to communicate with the outside world and activates an alarm in my tablet. It's a good thing I did it, huh? You did amazing. Excuse me? What's this shit? If you hadn't put that in, the kid wouldn't have realized what was going on and we would have caught him. Before you start bragging, think about doing things <gasps> right. I am the first person who wants everything to go smoothly, okay? If we leave here empty-handed, you and the fucking nut can get on with your lives. I am a fugitive. With no money, I'll get caught, and I won't get out of prison before I'm 50. If you try to threaten me again, I'll crush your head.
Irene, I'm here in your room, but I can't find your pills anywhere. They have to be around there. I left them on. Oh no! Hi, Ben! The monster's coming towards you! Gotcha! I'm looking for Paul. So much pain for this. He's taking the pills with him. Ben, I need my medicine. <laughs> Can you take them from him? I'll try. You are not at all like I imagined you, Paul. Married and with children. You have a very happy family, don't you? And I love what you've done to the house. You could put on a concert here. It's clear that you are at the top of your game. The problem with being at the top is that the only way to go is down. And a long fall awaits you. Everything that matters to you away, I'll do the same thing you did to me. Irene, I haven't been able to get the pills. yourself were you able to get help i tried but they blocked the computer somehow i couldn't do anything dad irene needs to take her pills but that man has them oh ben you need to get into my laboratory just above my study I, I, i'm sure there will be more pills in there for irene why do you keep the pills there don't ask questions, Ben! <coughs> Go up the stairs next to my office. 
The code for the door is 4891. Get in. Take the pills and get out. Do not touch anything else. Understand? They're heading for the cellar. Hmm. I'm going to take a look. <laughs> what do you want now? I think the time has come to explain what's going on here. The house is completely isolated. I've cut the landlines, there's no internet connection, and we have your cell phones and laptop. Mr. Richter, you have no choice but to collaborate with us. Someone will realize what is happening. You've taken a week off in your luxury vacation home. No one will be surprised if they don't hear from you during that time. How do you know all this? We also happen to know that there is a laboratory behind the door of the second floor. We have been hired to retrieve the formula that you've hidden inside there. Are these the pills? <sighs> yes, that's what you have been looking for. Take them and please leave us alone. He's lying. If these were the cure, he would never admit it. In any case, the pills wouldn't be of any use to us without the formula, not to mention the research data. Mr. Richter, you just need to give us the password to access the laboratory. We'll just take your research, and then we'll leave. Paul, we don't have any choice. Give it to him. They're lying, Jane. To use my research, it's not enough to make a copy. They have to be the only ones with the formula. And for that, they have to delete my files and then kill me. That won't be necessary. Of course it is. The formula's in my head. I created it. I have no intention of giving it to you no matter what. I need that formula. It can't be true. Paul, honey, you more than anyone should know that there are worse things than death. We have all night to play on your strings. Sooner or later, we'll get our hands on your kids. If you're not reasonable, I'll have to make my own music with them while you watch. Could you bear that? I'll leave you to think it over. Please wait! I hear something I hear nearby. Something. You're scared, aren't you? You won't be able to get away from me. Irene? Yes. Dad sent me to his laboratory to get your pills. He gave me the code to get in, but the door just won't open. I've been trying to, to, to remove the lockdown thingy, but I just can't. I think we need a key. Isn't there any other way to get in?
look down. Please don't look down. Strange. There's electricity in this room. Irene, I'm in the lab, but there are no... P Looks like another password. Is it for this Elsa? computer? Keep looking, then. They have to be... <coughs> There's somewhere. This will be my last entry in this video diary. Seven years have passed since Irene was diagnosed with localized encephalic leukodystrophy, the same disease that killed my father. I thought it was asthma. They said she wouldn't live more than 10 years. This must be the card to open the locker. We didn't say anything to her, her or anyone else. I prepared the medication myself and would tell her I was going to the pharmacy to get it. So she didn't suspect anything. With the help of Chrysalis. What is all this? I did some research and was able Irene? to discover a cure. I found a secret elevator. I, saw how much I think Dad go. keeps the medicine they in the basement. Couldn't turn Why is Dad want a secret basement? she answering? What if she had an attack? I have to get these pills to her right now. <coughs> the door closed on its own. I really hope I don't have to go back there. Scream, kid. Listen carefully, and everything will be okay. I can help you. I'm not here to steal anything from you. I'm looking for my daughter, Liz. She disappeared three weeks ago. She was seen getting into a car with your father. I just want to know what's happened to her, kid. Tell me the truth, and I'll help you. Do you know anything? I found this. I... No. I'm sorry. No! No! <laughs> Mike. What's going on there? I'm sorry. Your father worked secretly to save your sister. Very emotional. But Dad hasn't told us how he found the cure. He knew how to find the cure, but his company didn't want to help him. So, Dad kidnapped people with the same disease as Irene and experimented on them. He did terrible things to them. 
And when they were so destroyed that they were of no use to him anymore, he killed them and got rid of their bodies. Do you know what playing an instrument and killing have in common? Doing it well takes a lot of practice. Paul? Is... Is it true? Honey, you didn't know, but you suspected it. All those days Paul came here after work, all those nights you spent alone with the children, you couldn't help thinking about it, could you? Like a song that gets stuck in your head. You can't get rid of it. You chose to ignore it. Wake up, honey. Wake up. Poor thing. You fell asleep during the movie. It turns out the remote for opening the panic room was hidden in the car keys. And there we were looking everywhere for it. Dennis. Dennis Francis Burton. It took me a few days to remember my name in the hospital. I was imprisoned for weeks in that laboratory. The things you did to me. <laughs> Do you remember the night I almost escaped? I'd lost so much weight I slipped out of my shackles. With what little strength I had, I ran to the elevator and took it up. That drained all my energy. Where... where am I? I need to get to the elevator before he comes back. The elevator has to be around here. of the house. I was so drugged up I couldn't find my bearings. Dennis? Dennis, where are you? No, no, no. If I try to get away, he'll catch me. I have to hide. It. All I could see through the door was that skull watching me from the top of the wall. I was convinced it was death staring me in the face. It said to me, Where are you? I'm not going to let you get away. And he found me in the end. I just wanted to die. But you couldn't even do that right. Dennis, remember we need the cure? The boss needs the cure. It was him who told me all about you and gave me the chance to thank you for your care. But first, I need the password for the laboratory. I'll get him talking. No. You mean well. But you're a savage with no self-restraint. If you went too far, we'd end up with no source of information. I've got a much better idea. He needs his family, but we don't. 
No, 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 please. We're not playing games, sweetie. I'd say the lab password is an awfully cheap price to pay for her life. Isn't it? I know it. Are you sure? You're not trying to trick me, right? The password is... Four, eight, nine, one. <laughs> Hilarious. Kid loves mommy more than daddy does. Stay here and watch them. I'll see if what they say about the lab is true. Prepare the program. Come on, little girl. You're coming with me. You all make me sick. Ashley, come here. It was supposed to be an easy job. The sooner we finish, the better. You are a parent. You have to understand. Monster! keys and go through the garage door it's the only way to escape take the tablet that data this is all the data from your sister's research. salvation I can't let them take it i have to hurry and get out of here I'll be back to get you!
that damn girl go? Oh god. I hope Irene is okay. Like your father. I'm glad to see her better than him. I'm afraid that I'm not. Leave the tablet right now and come closer. All right then. Please, let her go. What are you doing here? It's over, Dennis. This has gotten out of hand. We can't go around killing kids. Their father killed your daughter. This is our revenge. I won't turn into someone worse than him. We have to turn ourselves in. There's no other way out. 